What is up guys, my name is Spectre and welcome to another entry into my top 5 Pokemon within each type series thing. I don't- I don't have a title for it. You guys voted last week and the bug type won by a landslide. Let me preface this whole video by saying this was a hard list to compile. I pretty much love every single bug type, minus well, pretty much every Gen 1 bug Pokemon, Heracross, and Scizor. Other than those, if one of your favorites isn't on the list, I'd still like it. I only put Pokemon on this list that I have the most memories with, and not just, I like it because it's cool. Remember that the only rule for this series is that each Pokemon has the type in question as either its only or primary typing. No secondary typing. One more thing before we start, look at how fucking cute Spupa is. It's not part of the list, but... Oh, he's like a little fluffy confetti bomb. Pew! <laughs> oh, man. Okay, let's start the list. Remember back in the day when everybody wanted Beautifly because they were rare and May had one? Well, I was one of those people. But I was also 10 and didn't know that getting Silcoon from Wurmple was just rarer than Cascoon. I thought that Silcoon and Beautifly were exclusive to Sapphire since I had Ruby and I always got Cascoons. So I just stuck with Dustox during one of my early playthroughs. And honestly, it was probably the first time I ever genuinely felt like a bug type could carry its own weight. Gen 1 bugs were a fucking joke, and Gen 2 bugs were a little better, but like I said, I've never been a big fan of Heracross, and the reason that I don't like Scizor is because I never had anyone to trade with to evolve Scyther, so Dustox was the first bug type I ended up keeping on my team. Until I got to Flannery. I hated the honey trees from Gen 4. Fucking hated them. Why should I have to wait? This is fucking stupid. Just give me a Pokemon. And since in those days I wasn't exactly internet savvy, I never thought to head to the net and find out about the clock changing exploit. So when I finally decided to slather a tree and wait it out, I met Combi. My patience had been rewarded and Combi sat comfortably on my team until level 35. By then I'm thinking, what the fuck? Why isn't this evolving? At that point, I broke down and looked it up on the internet. My combi was a male, and male combi don't get to evolve. So for a while, I hated combi. But looking back, I did have a lot of fun with him, so now he's on the list. Whoops, I forgot my Galvantula was a shiny when I was grabbing this footage. I'm sure some of my older subscribers are wondering why Galvantula is only number 3 on the list since it made it into the top 10 of my top 20 favorite Pokemon list. And yeah, it was there, but it doesn't mean that I have much to say about Galvantula. It does have the distinction of being the first Pokemon I ever bred for competitive battle, and even though it's a spider, which I fucking hate, it's pretty cute and so is Joltik for obvious reasons. Other than that, I really don't have much to say about it, but I have just enough to say about it to put it on the list, so you guys know that I like it. So, yeah, I, I like Galvantula. Again, I fucking hate spiders. So I'm sure you guys are asking why a Pokemon that's like a spider and a wasp at the same time is number two. And it's because Ariados was a Pokemon that I loved to hate. Back in the day, I never beat a Pokemon League. Ever. Not until Generation 3. During the days of Generation 2, I was young and didn't understand the importance of having a balanced team. So of course my starter, which was almost always Typhlosion, was a much higher level than all of my other Pokemon, which almost always sucked, because I like weird underrated Pokemon. So of course when I'd finally make it to the Indigo Plateau and challenge the Pokemon League, Will was always there to greet me by wiping out my best Pokemon with that stupid fat piece of shit Slowbro. Fuck you Slowbro, you didn't deserve a Mega. But when I'd finally beat him and take on Koga next, guess which Pokemon was always there to double team so I can't hit it, spider web me to prevent me from switching out, drain my health with Giga Drain, and play fucking Peekaboo with Baton Pass. Ariados. I hated Ariados. But as time's gone on and I've gotten older, I miss the days of struggling to beat the league, and so I have fond memories of Ariados and his fucking bullshit. Also, it took me until the time of X and Y to realize that Spinarak has a smiley face on his abdomen, so yeah, I, I wasn't very perceptive as a kid. 
I live in a small town in Kansas, so when summer rolls around, so do the bugs. And even though spiders and wasps come with the territory, so does one of my favorite kind of bugs ever, cicadas. Yeah, as a little kid, I found them kind of scary because they're kind of big and loud, but the way that they're represented by Ninkata and its evolutions is really interesting to me. And the noise that cicadas make during summer evenings reminds me of home, even if it is a little annoying. And so Shedinja is my number one. What is there to say about Shedinja that I haven't already said? It's got a cool typing, a unique ability, it's adorable, and it's the first Pokemon rumor from the playground that actually ended up being true for me. During the time that it took me to raise my first Ninkata, Shedinja made his first appearance in the anime, and fuck! That little motherfucker was wrecking house. Then I finally evolved my Ninkata, and 11 year old me was confused. 1 HP? And I couldn't fix it? Into the box it went. But even though Shedinja's gimmick makes it a terrible Pokemon for battle, I still love it to the core, even if it is hollow. I love you, buddy. Here's a Pokepuff. What? Just come on, man. Just, just come on. Just e eat. Eat! Eat the fucking Poke Puff! Peanut, eat! Eat the food! Eat the food! Thanks for watching! If you enjoyed, please be sure to hit that like button and subscribe to become a member of the crew. Let me know your top 5 bug types and what type would you like to see next time? Dark? or steal? Let me know and cast your vote in the comments below. Be sure to follow me on Twitter, Facebook, and Pokemon Amino, links in the description. That's all for today, so until next time, this has been Spectre, and as always, stay bueno.